there's a lot of stress involved in uh, living in the world of COVID-19. Um, the primary stress comes from being locked down and that you are uh, isolated from others. And this stress and this, these uh, emotions of being locked down can turn on to yourself. And this may become uh, a withdrawal reaction, a depressive reaction, uh, or some kind of uh, psychological instability. Or the energy can go outside and then uh, it might turn out to be uh, aggressive behavior outside, as we see in some cities. Um, the important thing is not to turn the energy inside or outside. There's got to be a way of dealing with it, uh, of alleviating uh, the stress of living in the COVID-19 world. And that's what I want to talk about. Isolation is a very uh, dangerous thing for human consciousness because human consciousness is not made to be isolated. It's, it's made to be always interacting with other people, with um, language, with symbols. Um, human consciousness is always an interaction. So if you're in isolation, this is not the way our consciousness is made. So, a lot of people in big cities live alone and what you can do is contact uh, others uh, by phone, by uh, internet, SNS, whatever. Um, the po important point is to keep interacting with other people and you can help yourself and also you can help others by, by calling them up um, or just chatting with them and uh, keep interacting uh, with the people that you know. And uh, that will be a support for both yourself and the other. So the second thing that I want to say is um, don't think too much. Uh, when you think about uh, all these stressors, then you get stressed. Uh, then you become, uh, you'll have more anxiety, you'll have more panic, uh, anger, sadness, whatever. So the point is, uh, drop the thinking mind and stop thinking. And that sounds like a very easy thing to do, but it's actually not that easy. If you really want to do something, um, you might, uh, for example, take a walk. And uh, while you're walking, don't think. And concentrate on um, how your feet touches the ground and how your next step touches the ground. And notice how uh, your body weight shifts with every step. Or notice the air coming in through the mask or face covering uh, and how the air goes out through the mask. So when you, think you're, when you catch yourself thinking, stop the thinking and bring your attention back to the body, back to your breathing, back to your walking, back to each step, and keep your mind in your body and don't think. That's the second point I like to say. Um, I think what is called focusing or focusing-oriented psychotherapy can help with living in the world, living with the stress of COVID-19. And um, there can be many ways of implementing focusing uh, with this situation. And one of the things that I want to uh, explain today is called clearing the space. Is, um, so don't think too much with your head. Imagine the situation that is a stress to you, let's say COVID-19. Then see how that is felt in your body. Um, it might be like a heaviness in your chest or something stuck in your throat. Maybe you won't find the words to say it, but you have a bodily feel, a felt sense of the situation. Now don't think about why that's there. Just appreciate that it's there. Just notice that it's there. And then find a place where you can put 
all that about this situation and this felt sense. It can be on a park bench. You can put it into a suitcase and lock it. And for everything that comes to your mind, see how it feels in the body when you think about that. And find a place where you can put that down. Then you'll notice that you have a clear space in your mind. It's like you've just cleaned up a cluttered room. And now you have a space to breathe. And that space, I think, would be very important to live through the stresses of COVID-19. So I think that you notice that uh, what I say about focusing has a, uh, has a touch of mindfulness in it. Um, and the space I'm talking about is a space of mindfulness. It's a space of no thinking, um, and rather being mindful to every breath you take, being mindful to your sitting, being mindful to your walking. And there, there is no thinking. And there, there is a tranquil, still space in you.